Uh, bear with me, please. I, I certainly did not have much time to prepare a speech here. Um, I, I want to I say to everybody, thank you so much. You can, our community can now breathe a sigh of relief, as, as the governor stated, and I can't echo that enough. Um, our work, again, is not done here. Um, I, I was very elated tonight when I got the call from Commissioner Soschuk, um advising me of uh, the revelation of what took place and that Mr. Card is deceased and no longer a threat to our community or any other community. Uh, I just don't want to forget the, the families that are grieving and will continue to grieve. I don't want to forget the law enforcement officials that have worked tirelessly throughout this whole event uh, to come to a good conclusion. Um, our men and women of the Lewiston Police Department, of all of our surrounding agencies, we have with us uh, Chief McGee here from Lisbon where, where Mr. Card was found. Um, this is, in, is vitally important to all of us that this conclusion came to light tonight. Um, we're going we're gonna to grieve for the families that lost loved ones here. Uh, we're going to continue to work. We're going to persevere. Um, and we become better people for it is in, in terms of working together as teams. We've learned a lot from some mistakes. Uh, we've, we've won a lot of accomplishments this evening. Um, again, I wasn't really prepared for this on a Friday night at 1030, but I'm very happy to be here and very happy to say the threat is over. Thank you. Sure. So our offices are being notified now as we speak. Um, some know, obviously, sooner than others. There are many that are still home. They're home with their families. And I'm quite certain at this point in time, we all know about this. Um, this is something that all of our law enforcement uh, personnel, ours and any surrounding community, has been paying, paying very close attention to in awaiting positive news or good news. And this is by far the, the best news we've had in, in quite some time.